Hi, as we get closer to the holidays, I want to um, remind you that we have some wonderful uh, possible gifts for you, for your friends, for your relatives. Um, of course, during the holidays, you're all going to be um, uh, nurturing your bodies and I think we need to also nurture our minds and so with that I want to point out that there are at least four or five books of, uh, that I would suggest two of them of course are from Calandra the two new books that we've published this year and one is actually called Si Parliamo Italiano and it is about uh, who speaks Italian in the United States and it's a study done through the census, using the Census Bureau, the American Community Survey, and other uh, uh, data gathering organizations. And so that is actually authored by two of our staff members here, Dr. Vincenzo Milione and Christine Gambino. So I urge you to take a look at our website where you'll find uh, indications of that book. And the other book is entitled Uncertainty and Security in the New Age. It's a bit of a heady title, and it's also a heady book. It's a series of uh, essays that were presented presented two years ago at a conference of scholars from Italy and from the United States dealing with issues um, uh, of sorts. That is this idea of living in this new age of post-modernity as we call it and what does it mean crossing borders and things of that sort. Both books are available. They're available also at a discounted price and those books as well as the other ones I'm going to mention and others still will be available online. You can find them on our website, uh, Calandra website. Um, qc.edu slash Calandra and that'll take you to our front page in which you'll see a link that says book sale. The other books I want to point out are published by Bordighera Press and they are um, no pun intended as I mentioned the first book hot off the press and it is the first book I want to bring to your attention is called the poet's cookbook recipes from Tuscany and they are recipes uh, indeed from Tuscany uh, of a Tuscan origin and uh, the recipes are interspersed with poetry by uh, m m people from the United States basically and there's a translation for each poem so you can read the poetry you can cook the recipe and you can also learn Italian by reading the uh, Italian translation. The book is put together by Grace Cavalieri, poet in a road right, and Sabine, Sabine Pascarelli, who lives in Italy and who is a translator. Um, the other two books I want to uh, mention to you are a brand new novel by Richard Vettieri called Baroque, which has this wonderful cover that I'm going to show you. Baroque. It's hot. This is also hot off the presses. Matter of fact, it came to us only two days ago. And it is his second novel. Richard Viteri is indeed an award-winning writer. He's also written for television, he's written for the theater, and he's produced many plays. Finally, for those of you who are interested in the intrigues of art and the scandals and frauds, etc., I want to bring to your attention another book called The Unscrupulous Scams, Cons, Fakes, Frauds, the, That Poison uh, the Fine Arts. And this is written by Nick James Miletti and it's called The Unscrupulous. And Nick Miletti is a longtime uh, lawyer, district attorney, um, entrepreneur, and this is his third book. His first two books, uh, his first book is dedicated to Italians without Italian names called Closeted Italians. His second book was on another intrigue uh, with regard to the Renaissance on um, Borromini, I think it is, and, and this is his third book that deals also with the world of art called The Unscrupulous Scans, Cons, Fakes, and Frauds. Um, some of these books we've presented at Calandra, some of the books for sale we've presented at Calandra, so some of you may have already gotten them, but um, they're available, they're available at discounted prices. And of course, finally, you can get with them, if you want, uh, 10 blank cards, uh, with each one dealing with a different painting, a reproduction of a different painting by our famous artist, Ralph Fasanella. So again, go to the Calandra website, which is qc.edu slash Calandra, and you can get all the information there. Otherwise, just um, email us, and you can email us with the link on the website. So I'll see you next time. Arrivederci alla prossima puntata.